built on a firm foundation. Now, you think that's true? I think so too. Now sometimes we can build foundations on all sorts of strange things. We can build foundations that aren't so strong. Do you imagine that a foundation of tissue boxes is very strong? Look at what happens I don't think a building built on a, not a firm foundation is a good idea to you. But I think a firm foundation is a much better way to build a building. Not that funny, Carol. <laughs> and you know, if I didn't have my robot and I'd sit on that and show you what a real firm foundation can hold. But Paul is talking about a firm foundation for the living temple that he's building in Corinth. And do you know what, what that living temple is? Well, funny you should ask. The living temple is each one of the people in Corinth. And just like the people in Corinth, God is building a firm foundation for the people in Plymouth. Guess what? Your people in Plymouth. So God's firm foundation for the living temple is Jesus Christ. And when you look, turn around, look at everybody here. Everybody here is a living temple built on the foundation of Jesus Christ. So how do we treat living temples? With respect. Oh, your parents have taught you about it. You treat living temples with respect. And since everybody is a living temple, you treat everybody with respect. Now, who does everybody include? Your it, no, well, yeah. But it also includes somebody else that you don't think of as a living temple. It includes yourselves. So you treat yourselves with respect, with love, with patience, because that's the foundation that Jesus Christ is building on. He's building all of you guys up to be wonderful, fantastic, incredible, unbelievable living temples. So you treat each other that way, and you treat yourselves that way. Okay? That going to happen this morning? Yes, it will. Let's pray. Let's pray. Lord, let us each be a living temple to your goodness, your love, inspired and directed by Jesus Christ. Let us not build our foundations on tissue boxes. Let us build our foundations on Jesus Christ. Amen.